Hey y'all, Regiment here from IBM. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a collection in Door Stack Generation. After logging in, navigate underneath the Artifacts tab, then go over up top here to the Collections tab. Clicking on that will bring us over to this Collections window. Then go over to this big blue Create button and click on Collection. Then it'll ask us to input a name for the collection, and for this example, I'm going to be grouping 100 survey responses into one group here. So I'm going to call this survey responses group. Now, I'm going to leave artifact type as a collection because that's what we, what we want it to be. But clicking on this drop down menu and going over more, you can select something else here if you don't want to create a collection. If there was a template here that we wanted to use, we could select it from here, but since I don't have any templates created, I'm just going to leave it as none. Finally, we can select what folder I want to live in and want to live in this survey results folder. But if we want to create something else, we can click on browse and we can create different folders from here. We can either select a different folder or one pretty useful tip is that if you mouse over a folder, this button will appear on the right hand side. Click on that will reveal a drop down menu where you can kind of create, delete and also rename folders from here. But I'm just going to click cancel out of that. If you want to add tags, you can do that so as well. But I'm just going to click on OK here. And when I click on the artifact itself, there's nothing inside of here. So we need to add some things to that. And to do that, we can go up to the top left hand corner here and click on Add and Add Existing Artifacts. Or we can create some from scratch. Or I'm just going to click on Add Existing Artifact right here. And I'm going to navigate to where I have all the artifacts that I want to upload are. And that is all of these survey responses right here. Some useful tips is that if you use this menu over on the side here, you can sort by names, IDs, or you can apply whatever filtering you want to, to be able to find the specific artifact that you're looking for. But I'm just gonna click close out of that because since I'm selecting all 100 of these, I'm gonna select the first one in the list, scroll down, press shift, and then click on the last one. Then I'll click on add and close. It'll take just a second for all these to populate, but they are all right here. Now, once I'm happy with everything, I'm going to go up to the top right hand corner, click on save, and then if I click on done. Now I can back up here, and if I click back on side of this survey responses collection, it will take me to where all the files are that I just kind of put all together. Thank you all for watching. If you have any other questions, you can find my contact information in the description below.